the newly crowned BMX Pan Am champion, joins us for a chat here in studio. Thanks for coming in, Tori. Thanks for having me. Congratulations. How are you feeling? Very excited, and to be honest, a bit relieved it's over. <laughs> yeah, I bet. How much pressure was on you going into this? Honestly, I didn't feel that much pressure. Uh, I felt a lot more comfortable, honestly, racing at home. It's not something we get to do very often, and um, I knew the crowd was very supportive of me all day. My parents were in the audience, and uh, I loved every minute of the racing. When you were going into it, I guess every athlete wants gold. How were you feeling about attaining that? I was confident. I was confident that I could do it for sure, especially after winning the time trial. That gave me a lot of confidence, being the top qualifier going into the next day. I knew I had the speed and I knew I was in control of my own destiny and if I had clean laps all day and I knew that I'd have a good shot at winning and to have a gold medal around my neck now is a surreal feeling. Yeah, what is, what is that like? Yeah, it's, it's unbelievable. It's the biggest race of my, or win of my career so far and <clears throat> it's uh, something I'll remember forever. So <clears throat> you win the gold and then what do you do? First of all, I just wanted to find my parents in the stands and give them a huge hug. They've, uh, they've been with me you know, since I was born, obviously, and um, they supported me through the hardest times, and um, to share that moment with them was unbelievable. What did they say to you? Uh, they just told me how much they loved me and how proud of me they were, and um, that moment meant everything to me. And so, a win in the Pan Am Games, where do you go from here? Uh, this is definitely, like I said, the biggest win of my career so far. Mm -hmm. uh, we have the World Championships coming up in two weeks' time. Uh, followed by the last three World Cups of the season, so it's a big few months for us coming up. And when you train, going into the Worlds in two weeks, I mean, is that a short window for an athlete like you? Yeah, it is. Definitely, it's a short window. It's a quick turnaround, especially with travel, but uh, as BMXers, we race often, so we're used to it. Uh, we're used to traveling a lot around the world, and, uh, you know, it's, it's part of the job. And what about injuries? How do you handle them? Injuries are tough, no doubt, you know, especially BMX being an action sport. Uh, there's always that risk any time you can go on the track. Um, it's something that we've all had to deal with and every athlete's had to deal with and I'm lucky to have such a centralized program around me that I've, when I've been injured I've been able to come back. What's been your most serious injury you've come back from? Uh, I'd say the, the last one I had with my broken foot it was the end of last year and um, I was on crutches for three months after the surgery and I've only been back riding on my bike the last three months or so. So to be at the level I am at now is a rewarding feeling. Yeah and what about the power of the mind right like when you were Dealing with a broken foot, what was your mindset then compared to now? Definitely when you first hear how bad the injury is, it's really tough. It's really tough. The things like it just comes up and bites you all of a sudden and, and then you're going to be out for months. So um, I refocused after the initial shock of being injured and uh, worked on things mentally. Um, I still went to the gym every day and, and did what I could and worked as hard as I could in physio and uh, I think that really helped me in coming back. Cool. And what a sport, BMX. Yeah, I think, you know, I, the racing's exciting. There's always stuff to see. There's always, you know, we don't like to think about crashes, but they do happen. And it's exciting as passes and big jumps. And I think the fans really liked it yesterday. And so now you're an inspiration. I know you're from Coquitlam. Yeah. It's a great town. What would you say to Canadians watching you here thinking, I'm going to do that one day? I hope they do. BMX is a fantastic sport. It's given me a lot in my life. I've gone to the Olympics and I've won a medal at the Pan Am Games. I've traveled the world. I've met, met friends all over the world. And I've learned a lot about myself as a person and an athlete, and I think it's a great sport for kids growing up. All right, great. Can you just give us a shot of that medal before we go? Gold winning medal. Congratulations, Tori. Thanks for joining us. Thanks very much. Tori Nyhaw, gold medal winner for Canada in BMX racing at the Pan Am Games.